Ma, I'm back in the store. Ma? What is that? Your scrapbook. I don't understand, Daddy. There are all these newspaper articles in here about girls in Fairview who've been strangled or murdered. Why would you collect this stuff? Don't just look down at your feet. You gotta tell me the truth, okay? Did you have anything to do with hurting those girls? you to, to be like this. Didn't you? What is that supposed to mean? This is my fault? Look, you're upset. Why don't you sit back down and have something to drink? You're gonna try to blame this on me. No way. Screw you. What do you think I'm doing, you moron? I'm calling the police. Don't do that. Put, put that down. I always said the worst mistake I ever made in my life was having you. Yeah, I'm, I'm just, I, I was on my way out. Then I'll make this quick. Tom and I have been talking and we would like it if you would move in with us. <laughs> I know it's a big change, but you've got to get out of here, Eddie. This isn't a healthy situation. Yeah, I guess it could be better. out? Yeah. This is what I'm talking about. This is why you need to get out of here. I mean, look at her. Dead drunk. Okay. <laughs> I'll come live with you. Great. So just pack your bags and come on over. I hope you like meatloaf. <laughs> you want me to come in and help you or do you want me to come back later to talk to her? Believe me, Miss Scow. She wouldn't hear a word. Okay. There is a house in the town of Fairview. Inside this house lives a monster. The kind who kills women. You may wonder how a monster like that came to be? The answer is simple. Monsters are created by other monsters. <laughs> <laughs>